Hi everybody, it's Robert Barber with the Muller and Barber Real Estate Team and we're coming at you here with our buyer series and this is a series of videos where we like to talk about the things that are necessary as a buyer that you should be looking at or understanding or getting educated about in order to make sure you're making a great decision on finding that next dream home. So today's topic is going to be 10 ways to prepare for home ownership. So the first one is going to be Decide what you can afford. Obviously, knowing what your budget's going to be is very important. Develop your home wish list. Number two, I always tell our buyer clients to make a pro and con list of what they're looking for in a property. It not only helps the realtor, but it also helps you remain focused on what you're looking for. Three, select where you want to live. It can be very frustrating to be moving from area to area to area with without knowing exactly where you want to live because it can become very frustrating and cause you to be very confused when trying to make that final decision. Four, start saving. It's always important to start saving. Even if you're planning on buying a house a year from now, it's always good to get in touch with a um, a home loan officer or a mortgage company to find out what do you need to have in savings in order to make that buy happen when the time comes around. Number five, get your credit in order. Again, that goes back to having that mortgage professional already on board, even if you're a year out from buying, to know where you need to be in order to have your credit in the right place. Number six, determine your mortgage qualifications. Number seven, get pre-approved. Having a pre-approval letter is very important in a negotiation process when you're trying to buy a home. And number eight, weigh other sources of help with a down payment. There are plenty of places where you can find money, whether it be bonds or gifts or different places where you can actually get that down payment if you need to, but a mortgage professional is going to be the person to help you answer those questions. Number nine, calculate your cost of home ownership. The mortgage is not the only cost. There's insurance. There may be homeowner's fees. There are repair costs. There are things that um, may come up that you may not um, be prepared for so you want to have a rainy day type fund in order to take care of any issues that may come because a home is a living thing it does have uh, creaks and cracks and stuff breaks and so you need to be ready for that and number 10 contact a realtor I tell you more often than not I'm contacted by friends that say they wish they would have had a realtor up front when trying to go through making that buying decision and it uh, and quite often it can be too late. So spend that time, contact a realtor. We're here as a resource. You don't have to hire a realtor right off the bat. You can get lots of your questions answered, but working with a realtor in the long run is gonna save you money, save you time, and peace of mind. So all this is gonna be down in the email below, and we're also gonna have a link to our YouTube channel that's gonna have lots of more information for you as a buyer, so check it out. We'll talk to you soon. It's Robert Barber from the Moeller and Barber, Moeller and Barber Real Estate Team. Oh. Uh -huh.